Hey guys, you probably already heard the bad news, but Kim Young-hyun has passed away. Now, uh, I woke up this morning and I was having a pretty good morning, you know. My family was over and we had a breakfast, we talked about stuff, and then they left. And I sit on my computer, I didn't look at anything up until now. So I went on Twitter, you know, I usually browse Twitter to see some stuff, you know, something like that, I, you know. And I saw that someone said that a K-pop artist has died. And I over and I immediately went to see who died. And it's Kim Young-hyun. I hope I didn't butcher his name, but Kim Young-hyun, just known by Young-hyun, he was the lead singer for Shine. Shine. Now, Shine has a special place in my heart because I remember back when I didn't even listen to K-pop, when I didn't even listen to BTS, I watched some of their music videos and I was like, Shine was one of the first K-pop bands that I met, that I found out about. My favorite song of them is Lucifer. You probably guys already know that. but. I heard that he killed himself, he also sent a letter to his sister, which is really disturbing. So, but I mean, at least she would have some closure, because he told her, he sent her, and then, he, then she called the police. Now, the way he died was he lit a fire inside his room, and the smoke killed him, you know, because he couldn't breathe. That's horrible. That's one of the worst ways you can die, just choking. It's like the same way as drowning. Now, one thing I wanted to say is that depression is not a joke. It's a serious thing. It's funny, but it's not funny. This whole situation is not funny. It's ironic because a few days ago I was depressed. And, you know, I was like, the whole day I was depressed. And I didn't know what I'm going to do. I don't know what I was going to do. But the next morning I woke up, I called my family. I saw your guys comments and I already felt better you know I was already better and you know that depression went away the point is if you're having problems in your life talk to someone trust me I know that sometimes you people don't want to show your bad sides I don't you want to show your emotional sides but trust me if you talk to somebody you would feel better much more because if I have a problem I'll always share it with someone who's close to me that person will tell me something that person will help me if they can, they will help me, they will talk to me. Just call your parents, call your brothers, sisters, call your lovers, boyfriends, girlfriends, and talk to them. Tell them every single problem you have. Tell someone who can understand you. Now that's the main thing, how you can ease your depression. Now depression is nothing to joke about. If you are to the point where you cannot get help from your family, from your friends, even though they could give you that motivation, that support that you need you should seek professional help I know this sounds really dangerous and like not dangerous but like like you have a mental problem it's a serious thing but it's not that strange all of us go through bad and good stuff in our lives and a lot of us are depressed you know it's a normal thing it's a normal human thing especially living now in this year when there's a lot of information coming from every side and you see all of these wars all of these terrorist attacks everything and not just that there's a lot of things also besides that um, Shina had a special place in my heart even though I don't listen to them now because I listen to only BTS and Big Bang and groups like that I remember Shina Lucifer was actually Shina Lucifer was actually the first music video no actually it wasn't <laughs> but it was like the second music video that I saw from K-pop the first one was like Big Bang um, fantastic yeah fantastic that's the first music video of K-pop that I saw the second one was Sheena Lucifer. I remember like it was yesterday, even though it was years ago. So, if you're having problems, talk to somebody. And, you know, everything can be fixed. There's always hope. Rest in peace, Young Hyun. I hope you find peace, and I hope you are in heaven right now. I don't know, I hope... I, uh, I didn't look much into it, but I guess it's confirmed that he's dead. But there's a lot of sites that are telling like he passed out or he fainted 
something like that but his sister confirmed the police confirmed there we go anyway guys thank you for watching this video thank you for being here for me i will be here for you if you have depression talk to me in the comments i'll try to talk to the most of you guys but if you have problems if you have depression if you want to talk about something talk to me in the comments <sighs> thank you for watching this video and thank you for following me into this thing called life isn't it amazing besides that thank you for watching and i'll see you in the next one Thank you.